Hey guys and welcome back. In this video, we shall see how to cancel an order on Amazon. Before making any order, you can check whether it is allowing the return or not. For some of the products, the return is allowed. For some of the products, replace is allowed. And for some of the products, return as well as replace both are allowed. So while making the order, you will have to check this thing. Depending on this condition, you will be able to return or replace the order after you have made the purchase or you have made the order. So let's say you have made one order on the Amazon app and you want to cancel it. So let's see how we can do that. First of all, you will have to open your Amazon app and then tap here on this U tab. And then after that, you will have to tap on your orders and then check out which of the order you want to cancel. Now after that, you will be taken to this page where you can get the details about the delivery. So it says it has been ordered and shipped. Now to cancel it, you just have to scroll here to the left side till you get this option request cancellation. For some of the orders, you might see this option cancel order directly. If you get this option, you can just tap on it cancel order and then you can just select a reason why you want to cancel the order like you made the order by mistake or it will not arrive on time or something like this but sometimes this option is not available to cancel the order right away in that case we have to go for cancellation request you can tap here and then you can confirm the cancellation from here after that you will get one option whether you want the money to be returned back to the same method that you used that is if you used your bank account then whether you want the money credited back to that bank account or if you want the money to be credited as amazon pay balance if you use the amazon pay balance then within few hours you can get the money back into your amazon pay balance but if you use the other methods like credit card or your bank account or your debit card then it's going to take four or five working days to get the money back into the same account so that's one thing the second thing is if you raise this cancellation request it will be forwarded to your seller if seller approves it then it will be cancelled but if the seller does not approve it or if the seller is not reachable then the next thing that you can do is just do not accept the order when it is out for delivery so if the seller cancels the order then it's very good for you because you don't have to do anything and the money will be credited back to your account within 3-4 days on its own. But if the seller is not reachable or has not responded to your cancellation request then everything will go according to the process and once your order is out for delivery it will reach you ultimately. So when the delivery guy approaches you you can just return back the order do not accept it. Or let's say you are not present at the address of the delivery and the delivery guy has somehow delivered your product then the next thing that you can do is you can request for return let me just open some of my other orders so as in this case this order has already been delivered and it was delivered on 17 february and i have i have been given 10 days period to replace this order so you can check it from here whether the return is possible or not in this case the return is not possible because amazon is only giving me the option to replace the item if i tap here then i will have to choose the reason why am i replacing this item let me return back let's check out another order of mine this was delivered on 9th february and uh, I have been given 15 days time to return this order so whenever there is a return available it will be available for 15 days if it is just a replacement it will be for 10 days so let me just tap here on return now after that you have to choose the reason why you want to return this item so you can choose any of the reason that you think is the correct reason and then you can add photographs to support your return or you can write a comment as well and then continue after that your return will be scheduled and you will have to select the time for the return so that the delivery guy can come and collect the product from you make sure that the original packing of the product as well as the invoice and any other content that came with the box is with you so when the delivery guy approaches you for the return you have to present everything that was delivered to you in the original packaging after that it will be taken back and hopefully your return will be processed and you will get back your money. 
if you want to cancel your order before it has been shipped or before it has reached you and there is no button to cancel the order or to request the cancellation in that case you can just talk or chat with one of the customer care executives of amazon they are going to ask you the order number which you have to provide and then you can request them to cancel the order on your behalf and then they will initiate the cancel request on your behalf and then after a few days you will be able to get back your money so that's all for this video i hope i was able to explain the return process of amazon if you like the video don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel thanks for watching